What's up, guys? Asked by back with another player review, and it is World Cup Stories Marco Asensio, the Spanish winger slash striker. Looks incredible. 89 rated striker, Spanish Real Madrid, 91 pace, 86 shooting, 84 passing, 89 dribbling, and 70 physical. His base stats look very good. He's six foot, high medium work rates, left footed, four star skill moves, and a four star weak foot. He's around 300k, which I think is pretty good for this card. He could play striker, centre forward or right wing. And I've put a finisher chemistry style on him. Attributes wise, 92 acceleration, 90 sprint speed. So he's fast, which is important both for a striker and a winger. Attack and positioning wise, 86. 84 finishing, 92 shot power, 91 long shots and 85 volleys. So he can finish. He's got good long shots and he's got shot power. All you need to finish. Passing wise, 84 crossing, 83 vision. 84 short passing, 86 long passing, 87 curve. He's got good passing stats for being a striker and also a great crossing for a winger. So to be honest, I think this card could be great on either winger or striker. Dribbling as well, fantastic. 86 agility, 84 balance, 92 ball control, 88 dribbling, 87 composure. We all know with those kind of six foot plus players that dribbling can be a little bit awkward, especially at pace. But this guy, I think, will have very good dribbling um, because his agility is good, his balance is decent. He's got 88 dribbling along with a 92 acceleration, 90 sprint speed. He should be very fun to handle. Defending's pretty woeful. He also can't head the ball. But he's got decent stamina, not very strong, not very aggressive. So my only worry of playing up front, he could get pushed off the ball a few times. But with that pace, hopefully he won't be caught by defenders. He's got a long shot trait. Not many traits, but yeah, overall I think it'd be a great card. He's in my La Liga team. And yeah, we're going to a few games and hopefully he can be a beast. So, World Cup Stories, Marco Asensio is an okay striker. Um, he's not a world beater. He's not fantastic, but he's a decent player. If you're winning like a Spanish team, um, a Real Madrid team, or just like the card, he is a nice card to have. I wouldn't personally use him. I think you've got that out of position, Anzu Fati. Um, you've also got that player of the month or one to watch, Lewandowski, who are better strikers than this card. Um, if you play him out wide, he's better out wide. He's faster, he can cross the ball, um, his strength isn't as important out wide, and his finishing is not fantastic. So you get le you're in less position to score when you're out wide, unlike the wing. So I think this card is better at being a winger. Um, he did miss quite a few opportunities for me. Normally the players would score, it's not just my finishing. Normally my finishing is pretty good, and he just missed, I missed a target or went straight to the keeper. So I think for 300k it's expensive. I think he has got that burst of speed, but his finishing is not great. Um, his passing is very good and his crossing is very good. So if you're going to use this card, use him as a winger, not as a striker. 